it's been a thrilling adventure. I was, a, I was always a very creative person. I was always full of ideas. So I was always raised in an environment where my parents always believed in me. And they always fostered that self-belief within myself. And, and in my parents' eyes, there were no limits to what I could achieve. And there were no glass ceilings, you know, to give it everything you've got. And I already had that type of mentality as a young kid and now as a woman. I think just now as Miss Cook Islands, because I had not only myself, I had other people there behind me and other people that I'm representing. So it only fueled my motivation to kind of give it everything I could. The things that I have had the opportunity to do, the experiences that I have had the opportunity to have. When I think about my mentality, that has been the, my greatest strength as well as my greatest challenge. Being able to project myself, my ideas, to have advocacies that I'm passionate about, I think these have served as strengths throughout my year. And there were moments maybe where I experienced a bit of self-doubt or I second guess myself or you know managing managing all the all the things that you're expected to to juggle as well as your life as well as managing being Rehana I mean that's enough on, on my brain as it is uh, that was that was a challenge and it's only made me stronger and it's only made me more self-assured and I walked into this journey knowing who I am but I definitely am, am walking away knowing myself even better and knowing that I am capable of so much more than I ever thought I could or I have achieved things that, that I never thought I could. So now it's time to reveal the 13 pre-judging choices. As you can imagine, it was a very tough decision for the panel, but here are their selections. <laughs> Cook Islands. So I suppose being Miss Cook Islands, with its challenges and with its triumphs, it's, it's knowing who you are. It's, it, it's continuing to get to know who you are. I am still getting to know Rehana and I'm still growing and evolving as a woman, but doing so as Miss Cook Islands has been a pretty remarkable journey and one that I'm I'm so grateful for. Upon receiving this crown, I was told, this title is what you make of it. You can do anything and everything with it. That has always remained in my heart when I 
try to seek out the different ways that I can utilize this title to benefit my community or benefit our youth or benefit our country or our, our tourism or our culture, whatever it may be. I always have seen this title as an opportunity to do more. I see it as really the beginning, really the starting point for so much magic that you can create here in the Cook Islands and all around the world. I am Rehana Kotekawiki and I am your Miss Cook Islands 2018.